Hi, this video is to talk about the uh, telephone wire color code. So I'm holding in my hand a 25 pair and I'm going to strip it back, use my lineman scissors, strip it back like so, pull off the jacket, and then in most 25 pairs there is what's known as, um, I don't know what the real word is for it, but we call it dental floss. The slang for it is dental floss, and that's kind of really what it looks like. And the reason it's there is to pull back the jacket. It helps if you make a little, a little uh, nick in the cable, the top of the cable there, and then put your jet line right on top. I'm sorry, your your uh, dental floss right on top of it, and then you pull back. And the reason that is done is because when you take your scissors and you make that roundabout stripping action like that there's a chance and maybe even a good chance that you're going to nick the individual wires inside and you don't want that to happen for two reasons one because if there's a nick it makes the wire susceptible to breakage right at the spot where you nicked it and two is it it you know creates the possibility of a uh, short two wires touching together anyway so you pull the dental floss back as much as you need to to expose as much wires you need and I'm going to use this to demonstrate the color code. So 25 pair cable contains the essential 20, first 25 wires of the color code. After that, it just repeats. So once you know the first 25, then you pretty much know the whole color code for, as far as I'm aware, as far as it goes. So you begin with your your whites. Now here's here's what I mean by color code. So you see all these wires have got, you know kind of different colors on them and like for instance you've got here a couple of wires twisted tight together and if I pull them apart you can see that one is kind of a white color with little blue splotches on it and the other one is a blue wire with some white splotches on it although actually the, the white's kind of hard to see and you'll see variations of this where you might have like a white and blue wire twisted together um, and there may not be these reversing splotches, you know, the, the little blue splotches with more white and, 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 and the inverse. Um, but essentially the color code goes like this. The first five wires are the blue-white and then the orange-white pair. Now, when I'm saying wires, I mean I'm talking about pairs. Each one comes in a set of two. The orange-white, I kind of want to get these together. The orange-white, then the third one is the green-white. The fourth one is the brown white. Okay, we're back. It took me a little longer to get all these cables uh, organized the way I wanted to, so I had to stop the camera for a while. So, you know, basically what I want to show you is that you've got 25 pairs of wires, so it's really 50 individual wires, but each wire is, is, comes as a pair. So you've got your, your blue white, your orange white, your green white, your brown white, your slate white. Remember slate is the word we use for gray. And then you've got the same set of f five colors repeating itself, but now with a new tracer color. So for here, everything was something white. Now it's red. So blue red, orange red, green red, brown red, slate red. And then it goes into black, and then it goes into yellow, and then it goes into violet. Now violet is the word we use for, it's not purple, it's violet. So if you don't want to sound silly in front of a bunch of telecom guys, don't use the word purple, don't use the word gray. It's, it's slate and violet. Okay, so I'm going to put up a chart uh, in, 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 a, in a moment um, which outlines this a lot more clearly. And you can actually go find that chart online. There's several places you can find uh, the color code online. But you need to know that there's five uh, pair colors, blue, orange, green, brown, and slate. Okay, and then there's five tracer colors, white, red, black, yellow, violet. So this is 25 pair. Well, what happens when we go to 50 pair? Well, the process just repeats itself, except that what you'll see, like if this, if this cable I was holding was actually a 50 pair, then what would have happened is when I cut into it, there would have been two groups of 25 pair or two groups of, of, of 50 wires. And one would have been wrapped in a blue, white, uh, for lack of a better word, let's call it a ribbon. It's just, it's kind of like the, the dental floss that, that comes in these. A blue, white ribbon, which would indicate that's the first set of 25 uh, pair. And then the, the next one would be wiped in an orange, white ribbon. And that would mean that that's the second pair. And then it just goes on and on and on again from there. So what you've got is, 
you know, this numbering pattern that, that never ends, but basically just is a repeat of the same, you know, blue, orange, green, brown slate, you know, with the five tracer colors, white, red, black, yellow, violet. Okay, all right, let's go look at that chart. So here's the color code chart that I got from wikipedia.org. You can see the top row has got the first five pairs, blue, orange, green, brown, slate with a white tracer. And then below that is the red tracer, the black, the yellow, and the violet. You can find similar charts all over the internet. So good luck with your learning and thanks for watching.